that one desire conquered is more satisfying than thousand desires fulfilled. Shri Prabhupada explains very beautifully that unless one controls one's senses, one cannot experience satisfaction. The secret to satisfaction is sense control. And that's absolutely very critical. And therefore, it is described very uh, beautifully that one desire conquered is more satisfying than thousand desires fulfilled. So therefore, we must wage a war against these negative desires. And human life is meant for this war to conquer over these desires which are degrading us. Because they appear attractive, but they ultimately will drag us down. In a temple they were celebrating Narsingh Chaturdashi, they offered a big huge cake for Lord Narsingh Dev. All the devotees saw that cake while being offered. They were very happy. You know, they were looking at the cake and doing kirtan, looking at the cake. And then after the kirtan, when they sat for prasad, the first person who was given the cake, he bit on that piece of cake. The cook had forgotten to put sugar. So it was not tasting good at all. But because he had been meditating on that cake for so long, he couldn't accept it. It looked good. It looked attractive. How it can be? I will keep it for some time. He keep it, kept it back on the plate. Eight other items kept looking at it. Again picked it up. That is called hope. <laughs> he picked it up. Thought that probably I bit it on the wrong side. <laughs> Turned it around. Bit from the other side with great hope. Did the taste change? No. That's our story. That we are bombarded with advertising that this will be excellent, this will be enjoyable. When the actual experience of the contact of the senses with the sense object happens, when he's shocked, what happened? And then, you know, it becomes difficult for people to accept it. And they don't have an alternative. But this is material life. That it is actually very frustrating. A gentleman goes to a doctor and says, My entire body is paining. A doctor did all kinds of tests including CT scan and this and that. He found nothing. Right? There is no pain in any part of your body. Everything is okay. Are, wherever I touch it is paining. Then doctor looked at his finger and his finger was septic. And his finger had an infection because of that. Wherever he touched, it was paining. So therefore, people say, whatever I do, it is frustrating. It is so depressing. No activity is pleasing. No. The mind is infected. And when the mind is infected, it is like that septic finger. If the mind is filled with the desire to enjoy, one will be miserable. When the mind is filled with the desire to serve, it will become blissful. So therefore, there is no way one can experience joy unless one's heart is filled with a feeling of gratitude and service attitude.